the most powerful name in local news. Fox 5 News at 5. 100 million Americans have high cholesterol. Now, sometimes medications like statins can help bring LDL or unhealthy cholesterol levels down. But they don't always work and sometimes have side effects. Health Watch reporter Beth Galvin is here with more on an experimental laser treatment that might help. Beth? Lisa, Russ, this treatment is in the very early stages of being studied. The doctors are trying to find out a low-level laser normally used for body contouring may actually help lower your high blood I've always been on uh, high uh, carbohydrates, and I love my meat and potatoes. And years of that kind of eating has led 60-year-old Stephen Schoenfeld to a life with high cholesterol. I go for an annual physical every year for the last 20-plus years, and then all of a sudden the numbers started to go against me. For the last 15 years, Stephen has been trying to get his cholesterol levels under control. But between lifestyle changes like diet and exercise and taking cholesterol-lowering medications, nothing has seemed to work. How are you, Steve? Typically, doctors prescribe medications to lower cholesterol levels, and those drugs help block the substance your body needs to make cholesterol and help your liver remove it from your blood. However, side effects like liver damage and muscle pain have patients like Stephen looking for an alternative. The longer you live without meds, you know, and maintain good health, I think the better we're all going to be. Dr. Mauro Romito is currently involved in a medical trial that is using low-level cold laser treatments to try to reduce cholesterol levels. Cold laser therapy is a form of photochemistry which uses light to modify the metabolism of cells. And light can affect cells in many, many ways. In the cells which store fat, or the more called lipocytes or adipocytes, it created a change in the cell's pH, a balance, acid-base balance, which resulted in the cell being able to lose its fat content, and the fat itself leaks out of the cell. Participants receive one-hour treatments three times a week for two weeks, and researchers are targeting the areas concentrated with the most fat, like the abdomen, waist, and lower back. This is sort of a photo chemical Atkins diet, you might say. You're basically taking your body's stored fat, which is already broken down, into a very simple component and introducing it into the circulation. It's being broken down and used as energy in the body in its purest form. Stephen doesn't know the results of the trial yet, but he says he feels good and hopes to continue the treatment. I want to live healthy. I do want to live a lot longer because there's a lot of the world I want to see. It is not yet time to toss out your cholesterol-lowering medication or to give up trying to eat better because right now laser therapy is only being studied in a very small number of patients. And even if it is shown to be able to lower bad cholesterol, it's really not clear yet whether the benefits are actually going to last over time, Russ and Lisa. So you may have to just do it the hard way by trying to change your, you know, things that are tried and true right yeah. now until we find more about it. Yeah. Interesting, but we don't know yeah. if it works. Stick with the basics just yeah. in case. Yeah. All right. Beth, thanks. thanks.